Mark, the junk bond bubble could be about to burst. The riskiest corporate bonds have been on a roll as the U.S. shows signs of recovery. But beware, two big-name bond funds are warning that that rally may soon come to a screeching halt. Caroline Salis covers the corporate bond market for Bloomberg News. So, Caroline, why are Loomis sales and PIMCO so wary of this rally? Right. So, at last year, the junk bond market had its worst year ever, and people were saying that the market was pricing in an Armageddon depression-type scenario that was too extreme. Coming into this year, the market's been rallying, and it's now a record rally. And now investors like Loomis and PIMCO are saying investors are being a little too optimistic with where they're pricing these securities. There's still a lot of risk there. The economy is still in, you know, this long recession, the longest in seven decades. And, you know, we should hold on a minute. And the Armageddon scenario, that's backed off just a little bit? It has backed off just a little bit, but there still are predictions for defaults to rise. The high-yield market right now is pricing in a default rate of about 8%, which is actually behind where it is presently. And, uh, you know, Standard & Poor's is predicting it's going to go up to 14% next year. Which bonds have been performing the best? The riskiest ones, as you said. So it's really been a rally across the entire and, market. And, and even in this economic environment, the riskiest ones, you would... I guess assume that maybe people would pull back from that given what's been going on, but no? Exactly. That's what you would think. And at the beginning of the year, when the market was rallying, it was the higher rated ones because of these default concerns. So but then is it time to dispose of the high yield debt? Well, Loomis Sales and PIMCO do think, uh, you know, it, it is wise to sell some of these risky bonds. What about the expectations for defaults? Uh, well, right. So as I was saying, you know, people are still expecting defaults to go up. Um, there, that is not slowing down, um, which is why the market is being too optimistic. Bloomberg's Caroline Salas joining us today talking about junk bonds. Caroline, thanks.